It was 1977 and the country was a mess environmentally and I was reading the, all of the new regulations that Congress was passing to clean up the country and found them fascinating. I called a friend who I had worked with briefly who was a lab manager, a chemist, Bill O'Connor, and asked him if he would be interested in a venture and he said yes. And so we got together and started working with the engineering and, and the chemistry side. So we began work on the laboratory. We uh, rented 1,500 square feet on uh, Nicollet Avenue and uh, we opened the business on August 3rd. It was very small as far as the laboratory. It was a, an engineering consulting firm. There was very few people, maybe six, eight people working in the laboratory to support the engineering consulting. So very small, personable. We had a lot of fun together, but it was a real small group. We didn't use the phones a whole lot. Of course, there were no cell phones then. Um, we didn't really email because email hadn't really been a thing yet. So pretty much you just went and talked to somebody if, if you wanted to, to get an answer from. The culture, I guess, was you know, very inviting, very friendly, uh, and that's kind of the way it's stayed you know, all through the years, and that's what's kept me this long here. Well, the first building that they were in was smaller, fewer people, less than a couple dozen people. Everybody liked working together and did things outside of work. It's just a, a very positive growing company, but it was a positive growing company when I joined back in 88 as well. We have a, a great group of really intelligent uh, and, and ambitious people who care uh, about the environment, care about people's health, and uh, who, who work here because they think they can make a difference and who do make a difference. The culture is one, we don't accept substandard work. Um, even if that means rework. It sets a standard for um, my employees on T, it sets employees, the standards for all analysts out in the field. Um, we have a strong ethics background. Um, we value our employees, we, we value our customers. Um, so everyone's working towards that goal. It's just the most stable it's ever been. It's, it's growing, it's growing smart. Uh, it's got a lot of opportunities for people. Just our ability to, you know, meet clients needs in a timely manner and uh, you know really going out of the way from you know everyday activities to to make sure they're kept happy. Pace employees have a passion for their customers. They in general really want to see the customer do well and they're really customer focused so we always want to provide the best service. Our mission statement's all about working together. Uh, that's who we are today. That's how we get our jobs done. And that, that piece has, has not changed in pace. We may have gotten bigger, we may have grown, we may have 2,400 people, but we all work together. We have um, a wealth of young, smart, intelligent team members, and I love the culture that they bring. They bring a lot of energy, a lot of excitement. We cause in effect a lot of things in the world. I mean we're helping things from environmental solutions to pharmaceutical solutions, testing drugs, raw materials. Um, we're, we're doing so many things that I think we impact people all over the world, not just here. And I think you know it's cool to work for a company that really has that kind of impact. I believe that um, that our, the industry we're in is a very fragmented industry uh, around the United States and around the world. There's, there's opportunity for us to continue uh, to expand our business, uh, to grow each of our, our divisions, potentially to add new service offerings to take care of uh, other needs that our, our customers have. I see our environmental division being the largest and the strongest in the environmental industry and I see our life sciences and lab ops being in the top tier, at least in the top five. I see Pace continuing to grow through acquisitions and bringing on new team members that could help us move our organization forward. The leadership path that's been laid and the foundation that's already here over the last 40 years really gives us the leverage to improve and continue to be a dynamic and positive contributor to the, to the environment and to our employees. 
I see us continuing to expand the types of services that we offer, the number of services that we offer, and continuing to go in, in a forward direction. I see us staying true to our mission our, and our purpose and, and our true north, uh, but I also see us diversifying a little bit more uh, into other areas as well. We have a clear vision of where we want to go and definitely uh, it is something that is driving every single employee to get better every day.